Hello everybody and welcome to Blitzpeg. I'm your host, JPEG, and today we're going to be reviewing a few tanks starting with the M4A1, the French uh, special tank that you can buy at the moment with tickets. So let's have a look, quick look at this. Hit points 1484, main armor is turret 90, hull 50, side 65. Not bad for side scraping a little bit. Concealment 47 because I'm carrying the um, extra things. Damage per minute 2462. Reload time 8.5. Armor piercing 200. Damage 350. HE 250. High explosive damage 300. HE explosive 53 and damage 400 so aiming time 4.2 dispersion 2.8 not bad so we are running calibrated shells to give us the extra 10 pin uh, you could run again runner rammer uh, for the extra damage per minute I'm running supercharged uh, vert vertical stabilizer or you can run the refined gun I will be running defense systems I'm not gonna bother with enhanced I'm gonna do improved assembly give me that extra HP I'm not gonna bother with these ones down here as of yet I don't run improved optics, I use the concealed camouflage as I like to snipe. I'm not going to be running the hull turn rate right because I want to have the extra engine power and that's basically it. So let's move on to the gameplay. As you can see we've picked a good um, spot. I'm sniping here and I'm being spotted every now and then but pretty much most of the enemy team is over to my left and I'm between these two flanked uh, hills and I can just basically snipe away. So I'll keep my mouth shut and continue playing. As you can see I'm pretty much averaging 395 per shot so that is a serious amount of damage that this tank can actually do. So 
So as you can see I'm not messing about. If I can take the shot I will. Even if they're out in the open and I'm out in the open, I will go for the shot. I've still got full health, so I'm just going to keep racking up those points, racking up the damage. Just got to be careful with this pan panther behind me. What is he up to? Oh, and he disappears. Not looking good. I'm going to have to make a decision. Yeah, push, push up this bit and go for the kill. And lo and behold, the right move. Come on, baby. And not too bad. So, five on five. Oh, what? Five. <laughs> not five on five, sorry. <laughs> two on two left. So, let's quickly move up this bit and see what's going on. Funny comment there, M4A1, are you very noob? <laughs> yeah, very noob, that's why I'm doing up so much uh, damage and kills. So shy of 3000 came first and as you can see it's not a bad tank, uh, it can deal out the damage if you play it right. So we move on to the next tank which is the M4 FL10 which is another M4 based uh, hull which has a turret which fires an auto loader with three shots. Reload times 1.33, armor piercing 144, 160 damage. And this isn't a bad little tank uh, for a tier 7. It can rack up some nice damage and give you some nice points. So, this is my setup. I'm not going to really go through it much. This is what I run. And let's move on. So we're going to be pushing up straight over here by these rocks in between these trees to get a little bit of cover and some protection and see what we can spot. And Leo VK. Looks like that one went right through. We come. Jack Panzer. So we are just going to stay here and see what happens. Keep firing. So as you can see I'm not waiting too long for all of the shells to reload, I was taking those shots as soon as I got the shells in I was just taking them. So this is what I love about auto reloaders, you can play them either with all three shells or you can just wait for the one to reload, it's down to yourself. I think it's time to relocate uh, these guys over here on the move. Be careful behind me. Got Sue, got the Leo. 
And I've only got one shell in. And look at that for a shot. <laughs> right, let's move in here. Right, we've got enough hit points, so let's completely reload all of our shells and go for the kill. One. Two. Nice one. Got reinforcements. Let's move in. One shell. Two shells. And bye bye. you thinking what am I doing why am I going up here why am I capping well I don't trust the team and I want to make sure this game is won so henceforth getting some extra points and now we're going to push up and support So as you can see not a bad came, um, we came first, we've got some good points, nice bit of money and on to the next one. So what do you guys think, this tank or the uh, previous M4, which would be your choice?
as you can see both tanks play completely different you've got this one with the auto loader which is fantastic but your your damage is going to be quite low and the other M4 with the high caliber shells 